Hi everybody, Sean Holsinger here from HolsingersFlyShop.com Today I'm going to bring you another fly, it's called the Big Thompson Special uh, Just a simple nymph pattern, real real easy to tie Tying it on a size 14 scud hook, uh, 1120 Daiichi um, 332nd multi-ude bead For my thread, I'm going to use some fluorescent orange um, ultra thread the reason I'm going to use this is it's going to be my hot collar, or you know, my collar of the hot spot at the top here when I'm done. Uh, it all gets covered up, so it doesn't really matter. Um, sometimes I'll tie it with black and then come in and tie the collar, but I don't want to make it too thick, so I'm just going to do it all in the orange thread. First thing I'm going to put on is a dyed olive chickaboo feather. This is um, from whiting the chickaboo soft tackle that we use for the taboo caddis if you see my taboo caddis I make it all out of this one feather um, this we're just going to make the tail out of this one so what I'm going to do is just pinch it down get it about where I want it for the length of my tail now we're going to just set it on top of the hook just about two soft loops down there okay that's way too long for a tail I'm just going to Pull that back about where I like it there, it's, uh, right in about here. And then we're just going to tie this down. Get it around the bend of the hook just a little bit. Give it a little bit, a little bit of a bend to the body, make it nice looking. And then we're just going to come in and trim this off. This is just a simple generic nymph pattern. Um, you'll see I tie a lot of my stuff in olives I always say there's lots of rock worms and that kind of stuff a lot of caddis or, or olive caddis in my area so I use a lot of olive uh, next thing I'm going to use is Senyo Wacko, Wacko Hackle I'm going to be using the Chartreuse Keller um, this is a little bit different than the standard for this pattern um, what it is it's like a piece of embroidery thread you can actually buy it at you can buy it from us at Senyu Wacko Hackle, or you can buy it from uh, your local craft store. And you see here, it separates into oh, about six strands there. What we're going to do is we're just going to take two of them strands off and tie two of them strands down. And we're going to just tie it down and wrap it back to the tail. The standard on this pattern calls for a midge diamond braid and you can change the colors up here any way you want we're just gonna use this um, I like this stuff it's real durable works real well we're just gonna keep wrapping um, when you use the two they kind of separate a little bit so when you start so just wrap and make sure you get all that orange thread covered up that's the key you want it to be green none of the orange showing through so just take your time and cover it all up and wrap it forward. Give it a little twist here, get it back together. And huh, do a little bit better job of covering this up here. Okay, yeah, the original pattern calls for um, midge diamond braid, which works real, real nice. Um, I use it too I, when I want to tie it in different colors that I didn't have the Senyu Wacko Hackle in. Um, you know, good colors for this fly is going to be like uh, root beer, the browns, any olives, you know, your greens. Then the last thing we're going to do is we're going to come in with some um, midge cactus chenille in black to finish this off. And we're just going to take oh, about a three about a three inch piece. You don't need a real long one. This is, like I said, very, very, very simple, simple fly to tie. I'm just going to tie that down. And we're just going to wrap it on. Build this up a little bit. 
a little bit heavier than my body there. Um, this cactus chenille has it's chenille except it has little flashy stuff sticking out of it. <laughs> Works real nice for this. Okay, now we got that wrapped on there. We're just going to come in and we're going to make our collar. Tie this off and make our collar. Bead where we want it there. Okay, now we're just going to put enough of this orange on here. Just enough to see it. Just enough that it'll catch the trout's eye. Put a couple wraps, and then we're just going to come in and whip finish it off. Just make sure you stay on the color there. And that is all that is to this very, very, very simple fly. Very easy one to tie. Um, like I said, it's called the the Big Thompson Special, the BTS. Super simple to tie, just a couple materials. Uh, you know, like I said, that um, chickaboo there works great for that taboo caddis that I have a video on. This is just another use for it. And I'm sure you're going to like fishing this fly. I'm sure it's going to catch you a lot of fish. Thanks for watching. As always, um, keep posted by subscribing to our YouTube channel for all our new videos when we come out with them and anything you need to tie these flies you can get them from our website wholesingersflyshop.com